Hey guys, welcome to Warcraft 3. So you may be wondering uh, why I'm playing this old ass game. Well, two answers to that. First, because I want to. Second, is because uh, they just got a really nice update recently. About two or three months ago. Uh, they basically changed the game and added a bunch of cool stuff. Uh, keep in mind, this game is from 2002, so that's like an update after, what, 15 years since release? For one, that's amazing that a company can actually put that much uh, love into a game to keep it going after that long. Anyways, let's get started. I'm just going to play a normal mode and just see where it takes us. And of course I'm going to start with the prologue because you kind of need to know what the orcs are up to. So let's get started. Uh, I'm going to start with Thrall's Vision because it's just an introduction. Eh, no one cares about it. You can find it on YouTube. So let's uh, get started, as I said for the third time in a row. The sands of time have run out, son of Duratan. Cries of war echo upon the winds. The remnants of the past scar the land. Which is besieged once again. arise to challenge fate and lead their brethren to battle. As mortal armies rush blindly towards their doom, the burning shadow comes to consume us all. to their destinies. Alright, so that's the first cinematic we get. It leads straight into chapter one. Somewhere in the Arathi Highlands, Thrall, the young war chief of the Orcish Horde, wakes from his troubling dream. What kind of nightmare was that? It was not a nightmare, young warchief, but a vision. Follow me, and I will reveal what your future holds. I don't know what this is all about, but I'll play along.
Alright, so this game is basically the origins of a lot of uh, characters you might know from World of Warcraft. Yeah, excellent. You seem eager to be on your way. However, you must first learn how to give orders. Skillfully done. However, the orc encampment is still far off. In order to reach the next banner, scroll the screen to the north by moving your mouse to the top edge of the screen. Very good. I did it. The path to the next banner leads through a black area. This black area represents terrain that has not been discovered yet. Hmm. Yes. Notice how the black area shrinks as Thrall moves through it. This reflects areas you have explored. Yeah. Select Thrall and order him to move to the banner in the middle of the encampment. Dabu. Aha, orc encampment. Lotar, my warriors. We are yours to command, War Chief. The spirits. Now that your this. troops are all selected, order them to move to the next banner. Hmm. All right. I can do that. Seems easy enough. I sense a knoll ahead. To order Thrall's forces to defeat this foul creature, select Kill the Knoll. Click on the attack button and then click on the knoll. <laughs> yeah, this screw you. Scout, but the knoll's camp lies just ahead. Order your troops to perform an aggressive attack move into the enemy encampment. To do this, select all of your troops, click the attack button, and then left click on the ground in the middle of the knoll camp. Regard the trouble. Yes. Master. I am. Man, these knolls are easy to kill. For honor. Good job. Notice that Thrall gained a level from the experience that he earned in combat. Only heroes can acquire experience, a few allowing knows. them to become incredibly powerful over time. Heroes Killing your gain stuff. A hero point. <laughs> okay, let's stop wasting time. <laughs> yeah. Dabu. What does space do? Okay, it just takes you pings, I guess. For okay. honor, War Chief, we've discovered a group of Murloc raiders in the nearby river. The Murlocs would make excellent targets for your new chain lightning. Ah, there we go. To have Thrall use his new ability, click on the chain lightning button and then left click on one of the Murlocs. Some oh, monsters yeah. drop treasure when they are defeated. Ooh, treasure. treasure chest hold power. Oh, this particular treasure chest contained a useful potion of mana. Notice that the potion now occupies one of Thrall's inventory slots near the bottom middle of For your screen. Honor. Potions of mana yes. can be used to replenish a hero's mana. The magic energy will allow the casting spells such as chain lightning. Yes. Alright. Dabu. Dear! Kill it! The wolf howl signifies that night has begun. Be wary, my warriors. Don't let nightfall dull your senses. Yes. Now, the funny thing I remember about this game is about, I think, here is an Easter egg. For honor. Oh, wait, hold on. Was it here? Dabu. Or was it hmm. here? Thrall is currently low on mana. Use the potion of mana. To I will find it for you guys. Dabu. Dang. Okay, anyways, let's stop wasting uh, time. <laughs> for honor. Dabu. What I was looking for was an Easter egg. Dabu. But I couldn't yes. find it, so whatever. Hmm. For honor. Why can't you guys move? Yes. Hmm. Oh, come on. 2002 AI, for guys. Honor. Bear with me here. <laughs> Dabu. Yes. An ogre. We'd have a fierce battle on our hands if the beast weren't sleeping. Dabu. You know what? Your time has come. We're gonna kill it anyway. <laughs> Cause we can. For oh man, that was a real fierce battle. Yes. We just killed some poor innocent Dabu. ogre. Oh boy. Yes. Oh well. For honor. Dabu. Over here. Honor. Hmm. This game likes uh, giving yes. you stuff for exploring. For honor. A golem. Oh. Watch yourselves, my brethren. Those creatures do not sleep at night. 
Well, of course they don't, Thrall. They're not real. They're magic. For honor. There's no real reason for me to be doing this. I just want to kill them. Dabu. Yes. I think there was a big one over here. Nope, just a stone. Alright, Thrall, you take the damage because you can handle it. Aha! Ring of protection. Dabu. Excellent. Thrall has found a magic ring. Rings are very useful because they provide a constant passive benefit as long as they are carried. Dabu. Okay, so in this game, unlike StarCraft, For the you know, hero the units are very important are as they can be revived when they're dead. And often in the campaign, if you, they die, you lose. I am the war chief. But they're really, Dabu. it's really different than StarCraft. Because it puts more emphasis yeah. on single units than For large honor. groups. Hmm. So we're here. Forest trolls. I still can't believe they were ever a part of the horde. Yeah. For honor. Nice little Easter egg to mm. uh, reference Warcraft 2. For honor. Hmm. Alright, let's continue this. For honor. Found him. The prophet. He's invulnerable. Let's get on with it. Greetings, son of Duritan. I knew you'd find your way. It was you I saw in the vision. Who are you? How do you know me? I know many things, young war chief, about you and your people. My identity at this time is unimportant. What is important is that you rally your people and leave these shores immediately. Leave? What's this all about, human? Human? <laughs> I left my humanity behind long ago. I am something different now. Know that I have seen the future and beheld the great burning shadow that is coming to consume this world. You sense it as well, don't you? The demons are returning. Yes. And only by leading your people across the sea to the distant lands of Kalimdor will you have a chance to stand against them. But how can we... I will answer all of your questions in time, young war chief. For now, rally your warriors and prepare to leave this land. We will speak again. None of this makes sense. But the spirits tell me that I should trust him. <laughs> and that's the end of the first uh well not episode i'm gonna continue now but first mission yeah mission three days later near the loron coast it's been three days and this prophet has yet to show himself hmm. i hope i'm not making a huge mistake by trusting him war chief the clans are assembling as you ordered but it will take them some time to reach us. Then we must prepare this camp immediately. I want my warriors to have food and proper lodgings when they arrive. Yes, War Chief. Warrior, has there been any word from Grom Hellscream? He and the Warsong clan were supposed to have been here by now. No, War Chief. We haven't heard from Hellscream in some time. Damn it, Grom. Where the hell are you? All right, this uh, episode or this uh, mission is telling you at the how to build. The indicates that your quest journal has been updated. To find out more about your objective, click on the quest button. That's fine. Okay, we must build a burrow, build a war mill, build a barracks, train five grunts, and there's an undiscovered quest. All right, so we're probably gonna have to train another the peon. The peon has been ordered to harvest gold. You will automatically travel back and forth between the gold mine and your closest great hall. Here are a few additional peons. To oh, increase the rate you. of gold collection, <laughs> order them to have Wish I could spawn more peons. You currently possess is displayed in the upper right portion of your screen. As peons return to your great hall with gold, your gold stockpile increases. 
Basically, these guys harvest gold from gold mines and give you resources in order to build more shit. Now that your gold income is steady, you will... training a unit takes time. When your great hall is selected, you can see a progress indicator in the bottom middle portion of your screen. This is one of the many uh, things better about Warcraft 3 and Warcraft 2. You can actually queue soldiers and units. In order to support a larger population, additional orc burrows will have to be constructed. Burrows Bro. provide the food that allows you to train more troops. To construct a burrow, select one of your peons. There we go. Locriga, no gal. In order to produce additional buildings, you must gather more lumber from the nearby forests. To harvest lumber, select a peon and right-click on a nearby tree. Now yeah. that your peon has been assigned to gather lumber, you will automatically travel back and forth between the go. forest and your closest great hall. Yes. Ready to work. They will also return the lumber to war mills. If that wasn't obvious enough. Well-placed war mills can increase the efficiency of your lumber harvesters. Try ordering a peon to construct a war mill near where you're. Right, we're gonna build one of these as soon as we get off. And we're gonna slap that bad boy down right about here. This guy should be about done. I'm gonna use him to be my builder bitch. He's gonna build me an orc burrow soon. We need more gold. Something need Why do we, why do we need more gold, huh? You're orcs, you don't need gold, you need food. Oh, we only need to build one burrow. Mm. Yeah, okay, I guess we only need one. We'll build a barracks then. Ready to work. I can do that. Be happy to. Hmm? What you want? It's getting dark. Spooky. There we go. Alright, what's over here? Watchtowers. These things attack enemies when they go nearby. Looks like they destroyed the bridge. That's not good. I am the war chief. Yes, yes, you are, Thrall. You are the war chief. What are you, what are you doing? doing? Uh, yes. Yes, there is something you we can be doing. More gold. Work complete. Hmm? Let's see, you work, can go work. help lumber. Something you doing? You can help war lumber mills too. Contain various upgrades that can be researched to improve your troops. All available upgrades appear right. as buttons in the War Mills command card. To research an upgrade. All right. So basically, what you do at War Mills. You can upgrade your units to increase their attack and defense and all the kind of stuff. Work complete. Uh, how many is efficient? I can't remember. I know there's a max amount. Is complete, you can begin training grunts to reinforce your army. Alright, let's train some grunts. We need more gold. What you want? Continue you stop being useless. Continue to reach your quest requirements. You have just placed right. a rally point for your structure. Whenever a unit finishes training from this building, he will automatically travel to the rally point's location. To place a rally point, select one of your unit producing structures and right click on the ground where you want the rally point to appear. This is all stuff I already pretty much know. I'm trying to get through as much as possible. We need more gold. Research complete. My Research life complete. Lord. How many more? Uh, I don't think we need more peons. I think we're actually too full on them. See how they're waiting outside the gold mine? Yes, I can do that. Okie dokie. Okay, uh, you build another one of these. Work, work. Guys, I'm gonna build a crap ton more orcs. I know it says only build five, but I'm gonna build a bunch more. My life for the We Lord. need more gold. Yes. Anything happening over here? Nothing. Let's get on with it. What happens if we cast this? Yes. Yeah. Ah, human. Okay. Placing another one of these. Uh -huh. My life for the Lord. Oh. Maybe we should upgrade this too. We need more gold. Yeah, I'll do it. Mm. 
Work complete. Look, regard, no call. Hmm. Something to do? I can do that. One thing I really like uh, about the uh, this game, if you keep on clicking the uh, units, more. they will save a bunch of funny quotes. So uh, just just listen. Hmm? What do you want? Yes. What? Me busy. Leave me alone. No time for play. Me not that kind of orc. Hmm? Yes. Hmm? What? Me busy. Leave me alone. No time for play. Me not that kind of orc. <laughs> they they all say some stuff like this. We need more gold. Even though. Let's get on with it. I am the Research Warchief. complete. Look, regard, no god. My people are strong. I will lead them to their destiny. The spirits will guide me. I may have been raised by humans, but I'm no fool. I am the Warchief. Look, regard, no god. Okay, so maybe the like main the heroes don't really say anything funny, but I know the orcs do. Master? Huh? The little yes. grunts. Why are you poking me again? Oh, hey. Busy. You orcs are in violation of the Alliance Internment Act. We've already captured one of your leaders. If you surrender now, we'll spare your lives. Warchief, they say they've captured one of our leaders. Maybe they're referring to Grom. I hope not. But if they have captured Hellscream, I'll make them regret it. Lok Tarogar! Come, my warriors! We must drive the humans back! Ah, uh, hell no! They captured one of my people? Mm -mm. No, they didn't. Oh god, they, they are attacking us. That's not good. I'm coming, buddies! Da 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 -da 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 -da. My life for the Lord. Uh, I don't think I'll need any more orcs for this, actually. I am the one. Yes. That's it. You're dead. You're all dead. Filthy hmm. humans. Yeah. The wretched humans have been destroyed. Move Thrall and the rest of your Ow. forces across the bridge and Double. locate Grom. Yeah, no shit. Uh, what was I gonna do? Go back? <laughs> this guy's like, oh, I guess I'll help. Was damaged during the fight. To repair a damaged building, select the peon, what click the want? repair button, and then left click on the desired structure. If I click this, they'll automatically do that. So you send them all the way down, they'll do it themselves. Oh, look at Thrall, killing this thing all by himself. Uh, sorry about the phone in the background, guys. Out of my control. <laughs> For honor. Hmm. For honor. Yes. Okay, I think it's over. Dabu. Anyways, let's continue. For honor. I wonder if this still exists. Well, I'm gonna try something. Come on, do something funny. Oh shit! It works? <laughs> I I didn't I don't remember it being so explosive. I thought they just kind of went splat. Well that was cool. Do it again. <laughs> that will never get boring. <laughs> okay, let's continue. The spirits are restless. Um, what you want? Send you guys down to meet with them. I am the gonna one. finish that. For Doom Hammer, your time has come. Right, destroy the gate. Hmm. This guy all the time. He's always left no out. Regard, Poor dude. No I wonder, does it work on birds as well? Or vultures? 
No, get over here. Ah, whatever. Let's get on with it. Pull one. Is it shift one down, please? Nope, okay, hold on. The shift, then control one. Us. Got it, okay. Yeah. That's how it works. Alright, let's Double. continue. I don't think I need to build anything else here. Yes. Look regard, no gun. Kill the humans. For honor. For the horde. I'm not sure if it works with things that are Oh, okay, that's cool. So your I guess it's all grown to such a large size so. that it now requires a portion of your income to sustain Let's it. Let's get on with it. This maintenance cost is referred to as upkeep. You know when we get past upkeep, we build another burrow. I am the water. So basically what they're talking about is uh now whenever you if you're over the your population limit, it actually requires more uh gold. So you actually get less every time you turn something in. I don't think it affects wood, but I know it affects gold. And if you go over that even further, it gets reduced by more. So you'll see your peons only turning in four at a time. It's kind of like a self-balancing system that prevents you from having huge armies. Hmm. But, you know, people yeah. build huge armies anyways, so it's whatever. For honor. Hmm. For honor. Look, Hello, poor human. Aw oh, man, we could we didn't even need to kill this guy. I mean I was gonna anyway. There's no reason to do this, but I'm doing it. Oh wait, I got a shaman? Where? Yes. Oh I got a shaman, cool. The spirits are resting. Okay, so you control multiple spellcasters at the same time. It often becomes necessary to quickly switch between them to cast their individual spells. By using the subgroup interface, you can do so without having to try to Let's select them individually. I am the Notice watching. that the currently selected units are displayed in the bottom middle portion of your screen by little portraits. One of the unit portraits Look is highlighted regard, with no a yellow God. glow. This means that it is the currently activated subgroup. You can switch between subgroups by pressing the tab key or left clicking on one of the portraits that is not highlighted. This activates that subgroup and displays their spells in your command card. Okay. For honor. You know what the sad thing is? I've been playing this game since I was like 9 or 10, and I didn't know you could press tab to switch between these. <laughs> oh, that's embarrassing. But that would have been very helpful before. Yes. Let me see. Purge moves all bust from target and slow the speed. He's got a gun! Get him! Feel the ground tremble. Right away. Right, let's go get some humans. Get him. Your time has come. There we go. Direct me. Okay, now we actually have more grunts than necessary. So I'm gonna put those in subgroup two. Yes. I put these in subgroup three. I'm gonna put Saul and Thrall in subgroup one. Direct me. Now these guys follow Thrall. And these guys Let's go this way. Look regard, no god. Yes. How can I help? spirits are restless? Okay, there we go. Ah, nice. We found where they're holding Grom, but the area is protected by Fortnite Grom towers. Then destroy them. Let's get Hillstream must be free. Oh, what are you guys doing? Don't be useless. Get in there. Power to the whole I am. No orcs dying on my watch. You stay here. The spirits are restless. Get the watchtower. Get it. Ow. Yes. Wait, where's the other one at? Oh, we tried there. Okay. For Makes the sense. horde, I am. What you want, Chugs? You guys attack that? How can I no, 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 no. Okay, you guys go this way. You guys attack that. There we go. No! He killed my friend. Bastard. 
You'll pay for that. Yes. Time for killing. Look regard, I have a lot of gold. Oh, okay, he killed my other friend. I wasn't paying attention. Damn it. <laughs> Can we do it? I am the war chief. Okay, there we go. Ron, are you all right? I'm fine, little brother. Luckily, they only injured my pride. Great, because we're getting out of here now. We're leaving the human lands for good. Finally, follow me. I have an idea. <laughs> we can set sail on the humans' own ships. <laughs> Perfect. But we'll need to wait for the rest of the Horde. The Horde is assembled, War Chief. We await only your command. Oh, great. All 12 of them. Now, go, young Thrall. That's sail a great army. The lands of Kalimdor. It is there that you will find your destiny. It is there that your people's salvation will be assured. Alright guys, well thanks for watching the first episode of hopefully a long series. This is one of my favorite games in the whole world, and it's uh, amazing. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy this content and you want to see more.